This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news, all right? So what are we talking about? We're talking about the game is preparing a diss track for Eminem. Now, Eminem challenged him a month ago. It was an indirect response to game saying he can outrap Eminem and everybody else. And he was like, you know, don't, if you're going to do it, rap, take me out, okay? Don't, don't just make blanket statements on podcasts, okay? Now, the game supposedly is preparing a diss record. WAC 100, of course, uh, says that the game plans to end Eminem's career. Okay, he confirms that the game's diss song to Eminem is dropping this month. And if he doesn't respond, he's a sucker because it's going to be very disrespectful. Why are you doing like, why? Why? Game dissing people for attention disappointing bro like you're trying to like you're begging for attention 50 please diss me back so we can have a back and forth eminem please diss me back. it's like come on bro but it's like weird you're you're at a point now where you're come on bro you should just be dropping music like this is stuff you were on over a decade ago over a decade ago i'm a big fan of the game and his music okay not a big fan of, he's like the meek mill of the west coast i'm sorry i hate to say it like that because i like meek mill's music too but he'd be he'd be doing a lot for the gram and twitter sometimes he goes through phases right now he's laying low sometimes he he'd be turning up and it's it gets a little spooky it's hard for me to decide which ones are more relevant someone says uh, why is he dissing eminem there's no reason exactly there's no reason behind it he's just like pure just out of nowhere drop in the bucket desperation the game is a certified weirdo at this point um and he's just tight because he wasn't a part of the super bowl performance he's very upset he's coming at 50 dre and eminem and he's just throwing this is game throwing a temper tantrum okay he's throwing a temper tantrum okay someone said how long before royce jumps in ig comments on it maybe like a day <laughs> I like Royce, but geez, he's like Eminem's spokesperson. Um, Rockstar JT. In 2020, I dropped Stick. 20, 2022, Dreamville dropped Stick. I don't know. They are way bigger artists than me, but these songs sound identical. Struggle. I'm so sick of people doing that. I don't know if I don't think J. Cole's like, yo, we got to get some inspiration here, guys. Let's go look for, you know. <laughs> Then we got Kanye West. Jason Lee speaks for Kanye West since he's now handling Kanye West's social media stuff and says there's no truth to him going somewhere to get help. That's made up. It's blasphemy. I don't know if you guys saw the SNL take on the Will Smith thing. That was funny. That was the, the, the funniest thing I've seen on NSL in maybe a decade, over a decade. I don't know. Maybe since the Drake one. Remember Drake 2015? That was funny. Anyways, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button. I will check you guys in the next one, guys. Make sure you interact with the video. Hit the like button, all that good stuff, and I will check you guys on the next one. Peace.